Hi, my name is Wesley Barrow, and I'm one of three co-founders of Nomi and also the Chief Revenue Officer. So Nomi is the world's first offline marketing platform that leverages multiple types of sensors in stores to help any brick and mortar business make the most of the store experience. So Nomi's customers are using this technology by placing different types of sensors in stores and then using the data to acquire new customers, to convert browsers into buyers, and to increase more loyal customers over time by using engagement inside the store. There's a lot of different you know, use cases across a lot of different verticals. Some of the things that we've found to be most effective is number one, doing zone level conversion, where you can actually match up zone traffic to purchase data from that zone to understand not just how well your store is converting, which is the historical way to measure a store's performance, but also to understand down to an individual type of inventory. So you can you know, add more inventory to that single store or take away inventory in that store, depending on what you're learning. Um, another use case we like to see quite a bit is being able to A-B test window signage so that across each different store in your location footprint, you can actually see what windows and what campaigns are bringing the most people in off the street. Especially with our beacon technology, you know, by leveraging beacons in the store along with integrations with some of the retailer and third-party mobile apps, you can start to actually create point of purchase messaging and couponing as well as exit promotions and surveys so that you can start to create one-to-one -one communication with your customers as they walk into different areas of the store. And that's great from an acquisition or retention as well as an ongoing you know, lifetime value strategy. One of our earliest customers is a regional salad chain that sponsors a music festival every year. And one of the things they brought to us as an opportunity was the ability to put our technology out at the festival to measure how many people interacted with their VIP tent and some of their on, you know, on festival cafes to actually measure if that drove the needle and moved the needle to their, you know, their stores within the different markets where they operate. So what we did was after implementing the technology at the festival, we started to look at both the time spent in these stores prior to the festival occurring, and then the time spent on site at the festival, and then the time spent post the festival occurring. And we actually found out that out of 20,000 unique attendees we saw at the festival, there were 1,300 net new customers created from the festival attendance. And then of the people that had not been into a store but had been seen prior, you know, which we call dormant customers, there were actually 400 of those who actually came back and were re-energized when, you know, when the festival ended. And then lastly, of the people who visited one of the on-festival cafes, we found that there were 180 customers who spent more time coming back into the salad chain stores after the festival took place. So on all fronts, the festival was deemed a success and actually drove quite a bit of extra customer lifetime value for the investment they put in.